Well, hey there, guys. Uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, some of you might wonder why I uh, am doing this with uh, the main light turned off. I mean, I got I got my uh, my other two uh, my one kind of normal size ring light sitting here on my desk, and the smaller one that's sitting over here that is uh, kind of connected to. Uh, to the little ledge here behind the behind my desk well there's a good reason for that because uh, I wanted to uh, show something kind of unique definitely very unique wanted to do a little a uh, little Jersey review but uh, before I get into that I uh, if you are new to the channel obviously welcome to the channel hopefully uh, you enjoy the content if you love it if you love Jersey talk hockey talk Anything hockey related, jersey unboxings, you know, like the video I'm gonna I'm gonna do here, you know, jersey reviews, anything like that. If it's anything hockey related, I don't care. I don't I don't care if it's pee wees on a pond. I will talk about it. If you enjoy it, hit. Uh, it'd be awesome if you were to hit that uh, subscribe button, and uh, if you really if you really like it, hit both like and subscribe. It uh, kind of helps the algorithm, and uh, you know. Comments also help too. I'm trying to see if I can get to a thousand subscribers by uh, the end of the year, and uh, that would be absolutely fantastic if I could uh, if I could get there. I think I'm like 60, 67 away, so that would be absolutely fantastic if uh, if uh, I could get there. And I would uh, really love to have have all of you on this uh, on this little ride with me. So with that said, the reason why. I don't have the main light on here was because I wanted to I wanted to show you guys something unique here and this was a jersey I was not going to get initially there's a reason why I'm wearing this particular this is uh, obviously uh, the reverse retro 1.0 for Vegas because I wanted to I wanted to kind of review something now here of course we have the Vegas reverse retro 2.0. Oddly enough, I looked in the neckline. Obviously, you can see here in the neckline here, you know, Vegas Golden Knights, 1995. I looked inside the neckline on this one. This one also flashing back to 1995. So I thought that was kind of interesting that that both both versions of the reverse retro flash back to the same year. So you know, I mean, you know, it's, you know, I mean, I guess that's when, that's when Vegas had their, had their hockey team. That's when the, the, the Las Vegas Thunder were around. But, uh, but I wanted to do a little review of this because this thing is one of the most unique jerseys that I have ever, ever seen. I wasn't initially going to get it. I really wasn't. But. There was just something about this jersey that just I I had I had to get it, and it is something so cool. I mean, you know, and you, you, I mean, even from a distance, you can't really tell that there's you know anything else inside the letters here. I mean, the gold, the gold around here, of course, is fantastic. I love I love that gold there. The gold around the neckline, very similar to here. Of course we have the the gold on the sleeves similar to that obviously this is black that's you know that's got the gray in it of course that's black though there but uh this jersey is very unique you know i mean obviously you got the you know the gold down at the bottom the prime the prime green there the vegas golden knights logo there of course you have it there one big difference here, this is the 1.0. This is not embroidered. This is. And honestly, I think that one looks a little better than that one. The gold stands out more here than on that. But that's not the reason why I wanted to give a little review on this. This thing, like I said, I wasn't planning on getting it. But I saw pictures, and when I saw the pictures, 
I said, I have to have it. And you might wonder why? Well, you're going to see here, you'll, you, you won't, you won't see me. You'll probably, you'll hear me though, because I wanted to show this off. Let's, uh, okay. There's one. And here, if I can find the thing here and here is two. Now, of course, you can, you can barely see me, but this is what I wanted to show. And this is why I had to get this jersey. This is some of the, this is one of the neatest things I think I have ever, ever seen. A glow-in-the-dark jersey. I mean, now, of course, on, on the camera here, it might not, it doesn't uh, quite show as much I mean there you know you can kind of see it but you know if you go back I mean it doesn't quite because I mean there is a little light here but when it's fully dark I mean you can and you can still kind of see it this is a very bright this ends up being a very bright green this I mean obviously it doesn't quite show as much on the camera because like I said it's you know, there's still a little light from the the camera here, but I mean to see just how 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 that is. And I put a picture. I think I put a I think I put a picture on my Facebook and uh, and I think on Instagram where I took a picture of the glow in the dark feature here. And again, it is just it is so cool. It is one of the coolest things that I think I have ever seen. And of course, you know, you hold it back here. It doesn't quite show up, unfortunately, because it seems like there's, you know, there is a little, a little bit of light here from the, from the phone camera, but, but I mean, you can see where it's, where it kind of glows and, uh, you know, it's just, it's, it's something else. And I mean, I've, I've, again, I wasn't going to get it until I saw that it glows in the dark like that. And it is just one of the coolest things that I think I'd ever seen. I mean, a fully glow in the dark. Again, I wish that I wish the phone camera could pick it up a little better, but, but, uh, it is, it is just amazing. And I'm trying to think, how let's see here if I can do this if I can put this up in a spot where it might be seen a little better maybe not exactly sure how that's to see if it's in a darker spot of the room it sh it shows up better or at least it seems like it shows up better Let's try that real quick here. Now, we're gonna pick. We're picking the. We're picking the camera up here. Again, you can kind of see me here in the dark. I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna swap this around and see if it shows up a little better. Okay, so here we go over and. And I guess in a way it kind of does. It doesn't quite show up as as well on the on the on the camera as it does when it's uh, completely in the dark. But it is a, a very cool. It is a very cool look. It really is a glow. I mean, a glow in the dark. A glow in the dark jersey is just an amazing thing. Again, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Obviously not the not the greatest there. In a fully dark room, this shows up really, really nice. I was kind of hoping that that would have shown up a little better. But in a fully dark room where there's like no light, this shows up really, really cool. 
But uh, unfortunately, it doesn't really show up real well with a little bit here. So there it turns around. And again, I mean, there you got the, you got the close up there. I mean, you can kind of, you can kind of see if the, yeah, not the great, not, not exactly the greatest, uh, not the greatest of, uh, of looks there. So there's kind of an idea of what this looks like in the dark. I was, I was hoping turning the light off, the turning the lights off with the, the, the phone camera here that it would have showed up a little bit better. It uh, unfortunately didn't, but it is something else. When you see it, it is one of the coolest things that, you know, that, that, I, that I've seen. And I think what I will probably do is I will probably, because I took a picture of it in the dark with it fully, uh, fully illuminated, basically. And I think I'll probably use that as the thumbnail for the video. But, uh, yeah, this is, this is one of the coolest things that, one of the coolest things I'd ever seen. A glow-in-the-dark hockey jersey. How many, how many hockey jerseys have you ever seen that glow in the dark? This would be the first one. Now, again, I wonder, I do kind of wonder, the glow-in-the-dark feature that is around the letters here. Not sure if you can kind of see where the glow-in-the-dark parts are. You can kind of see where it, where it is here and around the uh, around the edge there. I don't know if if you wash this, if that feature disappears or not. Not, not exactly sure if that disappears or not. I would hope that it doesn't. But, again, first time I'd ever seen a glow-in-the-dark hockey jersey. But uh, I'd love to know what you guys think. If you guys haven't gotten that jersey yet, do you plan on getting it? And, uh, you know, if you, cause if, if you do put it in the dark, get a picture of it. It it's, it's amazing. It is an amazing thing. Now I am curious. I've heard it looks amazing too under a black light. I don't know yet. I haven't gotten a chance to actually see what this looks like under a black light. I think that would look absolutely amazing, but, uh, but yeah, so that's just kind of a little review of my glow-in-the-dark uh, Vegas jersey. Like I said, on camera, unfortunately, it didn't show up as, as good as I had hoped. But uh, I think you'll see in the thumbnail that uh, it shows up pretty nice. So let me know what you guys think. Do you guys plan on getting this jersey? If, uh, or, or, if you, or if you have it already. Uh, I'd love to. Uh, I'd love to know if you guys have that already, or if you plan on getting it. I will. Uh, I'll put the link to the to the uh, Discord in the uh, description of the video, and uh, and yeah. So I uh, I thank you guys for being here. Uh, again, let me know what you guys think about a the glow in the dark Vegas jersey. Like I said, I'm sorry it didn't show up as good as I thought it would have on on uh on the camera here even in the dark but uh you know let me know what you guys think and again if you were new or you've been here before and you uh you know you enjoyed the content it would be awesome if you were to hit that uh, hit that like button it really helps the algorithms and uh you know if you if you really enjoy the content hit that subscribe button hit both of them that would that would be amazing and uh, again Comment below, hit like and subscribe if you haven't done so already, and uh, let me know what you guys think. I'll see you guys later.